Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of RTHD. In this episode, I want to show you guys how to use the keyboard hotkeys to actually control the switching between the different scenes in Streamlabs OBS, so stay tuned. All right guys, so we're back. And the first thing I wanna mention is that I actually use OBS Studio, well, Streamlabs OBS, in order to actually do some of my videos. In fact, this video is actually being done live and recorded live. So what you're seeing is nothing edited, nothing actually, uh, you know, spending a lot of time doing pre-work and cutting out things and so forth. That's not actually happening here. And so it's really, really important to be able to switch from scene to scene. Now, the thing is, you would have heard perhaps a click that I used to change the scenes. Now, I want to show you guys, instead of using the mouse, because, in, you know, a lot of the times uh, my, my, my monitor is to the left here and I have to actually look to the left when I'm actually recording. Well, you know, that could be a little bit distracting and so forth. And so this can actually be used for even when you're doing live video, as well as, of course, if you're setting up an actual studio system where you want to um, switch cameras very quickly and the producer wants to switch those cameras quickly, well, this is for you. Now, I actually um, had a little bit of difficulty trying to find this thing out, but I finally found it out and I thought it would be very useful. So let's get into it right now. Um, what you're gonna see here is my actual recording. What's actually happening here um, is uh, the desktop here uh, with OBS Studio. It's gonna be a little bit distracting because obviously with OBS, you know, you see things inside things when you're recording and so forth. But nevertheless, this is what uh, Streamlabs OBS looks like. Uh, for those of you who don't know, I think you know, most of, the, most of you who are looking at this would have Streamlabs OBS already. And now, as you can see on the left here, we already have our scene set up. I have many scenes set up, but my most, most primary scenes that I actually have is the uh, Logi 1080p and the Logi 2. I actually have two. So uh, I can, just to switch between both, you'll actually see that one actually is for like phone, uh, you know, piano, that kind of stuff. And the other one is, of course, the full screen one that you're actually seeing right here. I'm going to flip back again to the desktop here where we're going to have a look at, of course, Streamlabs OBS. And uh, what you want to do is click on this gear icon, which when you move your mouse over, it actually says settings. So you want to click on that. And then you want to go down to hotkeys, which is also a gear icon. And in there, you will actually um, have many different options you can choose. So you might, you know, you, you will have to actually spend some time going through all of these. But I want to show you guys how to do the transitions and the switching with the hotkeys. So what you would have to do is um, under each heading or setting, you would actually see there's a heading with the plus sign here and it's already open. So you wanna scroll down. I couldn't figure out where it was, but it's actually at the bottom of each one. So you see switch to scene and you see I have control five. So all you have to do is actually click inside here and put any button that you want, press any button that you want. I will make sure it's control five and uh, there you go. So for example, um, if I have the first scene, uh, you, I, I could choose, you know, control one, and then my second scene could be control two, and then my third scene control three, etc. And that's how I programmed it. Um, that's how I set it up using this. So to really switch the scene, just put in your hotkey, just type the hotkey in, and that should save it. And then you click done, and that's pretty much it. Now, let me just show you guys how this actually works, because right now, uh, what you should hear is me on the keyboard switching scenes. So let's, let's, let's get to that. I'm control one. You see, I switched the scene there, which is nice. Control two, that is, of course, my next camera here, which you can see here. And control three is actually supposed to be, I think it's up here right back. Uh, scene. I also have our scene for live. And then, of course, back to this uh, OBS screen that you just saw. So, guys, if you did actually like this tutorial, this simple tutorial, please like and subscribe for more. If you have any questions, let me know. I'll be really, really happy. Just comment below and I'll be really, really happy to respond. And of course, if I have to make a video to explain something, this is how I'll do it. So thanks again. I'll see you guys again soon on another episode of RTHD coming to a YouTube screen near you. Bye.